Hi, I'm Ellie. I'm a senior and I play field hockey at Sacred Heart. Hi, I'm Olivia. I'm a senior and I play field hockey at Sacred Heart. <laughs> Hi, I'm Catherine. Hi, I'm Caitlin. And we're swimmers. Hi, I'm Athena. I'm Ryan. I'm Hillary. And we're seniors on the lacrosse team. And we're playing lacrosse in college. Hi, I'm Juliana and I am a coxswain for the rowing team here and I'm a senior at Sacred Heart. I started playing, I'd say, around fifth grade. Um, well, I played ice hockey first, and then I started playing in seventh grade. Um, and it's like some sometimes like the stick work's kind of similar, so like it kind of came to me a little, but not super. <laughs> I like swimming because it's an individual sport, and you have to like make yourself work. But also like having a team there makes it so much better, and you're like so close with them because of how hard it can be at times. Well, I think we've all been playing lacrosse like our whole lives and so like to speak for all of us that like we really can't imagine what our lives would be like without it. And I think in particular just the team dynamic and being able to like play the sport that you love, it's something that we're all obsessed with. Also definitely. like the sport just like makes me a happier person. Yeah. Like <laughs> it's just great. I did a lot of sports when I was younger, so I went throughout um, a lot of different sports and I found that field hockey kind of came the easiest to me. Um, and once I started doing more camps and doing more clinics, I just found that it was something I was most passionate about. So I think I decided to row in college my junior year of high school because that was the time that I kind of started looking at schools and I was thinking about the next four years and I think that not being able to row would be something that was missing out of my schedule and my daily routine since it's just so a part of me. I felt like going to college without it just wouldn't be possible. Well, swimming is such a huge time commitment, like we do it two or three hours a day. And I can't, like now, it's just a part of my life, like I can't imagine not doing it in college. So I, I always knew like I'm kind of a person who's like very hyper and like I <laughs> am someone who's like made for a sport in college. I just, in high school, I didn't know what it was until about, I'd say freshman year. Um, I kind of knew that I really liked the team dynamic and I'd want to experience that throughout college as well. Um, I chose the Naval Academy because I always knew I wanted to serve our country. So that was my main, um, that was the main reason why I chose it. Um, basically I've known I've wanted to play lacrosse in college like for as long as I can remember. I know that's always something I wanted to do. Um, and Boston College was like the first place that I fell in love with and it's kind of the only place I really knew. And I knew like when I went there that this was like the only place I wanted to be with my life. So you know, that's what I did. So I decided to choose Bucknell because I wanted a good academic school and at the same time with a competitive rowing team. So I think going through the recruitment process, you need to make sure that you find a place for the academics, not just the sport. I'm excited about preseason. Um, I'm excited to meet all the new girls on the team and to be a freshman again rather than a senior, uh, to kind of be treated as the new baby. Um, I think I also knew that I've always wanted to play lacrosse in college. That's something that I just, like, whenever I was little, like that was something I was always like dreaming towards. And so for me, like I knew Cornell was the place for me because it's the perfect balance of everything that I want, um, both academically and athletically. And so to have the opportunity to like do what I love at the place that I love, um, I'm really excited.